but they actually released a statement saying that they're working, um, they actually are going to work with the government on a three-year plan, and that plan should address all concessions in Belize. Um, we have to now push to ensure that we see that three-year plan because we don't know what that plan will look like. We know what we have recommended to them, but we don't know what that plan will look like. I know what the government is recommending to them is that they put buffer around the marine protected areas which make up the World Heritage Site, which makes no sense when you think about it. It's not land where you can put up a block and say, I'm going to block off wall if, if there's an oil spill. The, the marine environment is so dynamic that you can't, you can't block it off, so a buffer does not work. When we did our buffer system, when we applied a buffer, it actually blocked off the whole entire offshore. So it's interesting to see, it would be interesting to see what is being recommending, recommended. The government of Belize, um, via the Prime Minister's comments to the delegation, was that a roadmap charting the way forward to make sure that the key threats outlined to that visit um, would be embarked upon. So again, how does the Ministry of Energy reconcile the draft guidelines that they've shared with those types of